Well, Mr. Jones and Surinda, yes. welcome you know, to, you. To, to Business Way TV. Uh, we are here at the GEFE, uh, organized by Eurocham, and it's very busy. There's a lot of people here, um, you know, uh, joining the, the, the talks, joining the innovation, joining the workshops. So, um, can you tell me something about, you know, your company, what you do, uh, and of course, you know, how it contributes to what GEFE is doing here the next three days? Sure. Well, this, thank you for inviting us. Uh, we are very pleased to be uh, part of the GFE today, a uh, busy event. Um, I represent Ashake Group. Mm -hmm. uh, we are fighting and proposing alternative to plastic uh, solution packaging uh, for business. So we propose biodegradable, compostable, and now water soluble solution for any kind of business to stop this plastic crisis and this plastic pollution like that is terrible in Vietnam. So we develop our own material and own recipe to until the finished product to propose to all the manufacturer, retail, farming, any kind of, uh, of business. Okay. That's fantastic. So when you think about uh, you know recycling plastic and recycling the compost, what are the typical products that we need to think about after the composting is is, is completed? Yeah. So. Today, there is two big trends in uh, alternative to plastic. So it's all recycled uh, plastic and all compostable and biodegradable. Um, I'm really seeing like recycle as this place uh, for all big parts, uh, big piece of plastic. But for all flexible packaging, it's very difficult to recycle. And is where we choose to have biodegradable and compostable. Uh, today in Vietnam, we're missing infrastructure and waste management uh, to be very efficient in this way. Uh, we hope like the government and authorities will uh, push forward in, uh, in this direction. And with all the engagement to taken in uh, COP26, I think it will come very shortly. Very true. So <clears throat> just to, to get a bit of an image, right, the picture. Once companies decide to work with your company yes. to, to compost and downgrades the, the, the you know the plastic waste mm. and they're producing mm. um, high level how would usually a project like that work how would you work together in order to help them um, uh, you know compost mm. the plastic waste that they have often when a client come to uh, to see us they have a really big problem uh, to get rid of this plastic that they're using uh, this plastic waste and making so we're coming with a full solution uh, often they don't have much solution provided in Vietnam. So we come and develop for them a perfect packaging and a right solution for them, for their business, uh, fitting uh, their, their needs and their requirements, and as well to be sure like it's safe for environment and mankind. Okay. So they are packaging who can be completely will degrade safely in the environment uh, without leaving any pollution. Fantastic. And we provide the solution from A to Z. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's great. And then you know, thinking about you know today's overall uh, packaging and recycling uh, needs, essentially, with with you know the the, the waste of uh, that, that we are all producing, essentially. Uh, what are some of the main trends that you see, um, you know, in, in, in the packaging industry and the plastic recycling industry mm -hmm. that you guys can uh, can can provide for? What are some of the main trends there? We, we believe and we, uh, we focus our development on a new kind of uh, product with uh, water soluble, biodegradable and marine safe. Um, in many of countries where the waste management is not optimum, uh, we see all this flexible packaging going to the nature, going to the ocean. Uh, we know that Vietnam today is the fourth biggest marine polluter. And it's why we developed this new material that in any case, any end of life, it will be safe. Okay, so we believe this trend will be the future of packaging. I don't know how long it will take. I hope not so long, uh, but yeah, it's a trend we sh we we choose we choose to follow. So, yeah. mm -hmm. Very true. Mm -hmm. So when you look at uh, the GEFE, uh, you know, convention, the, the these three days, mm -hmm. um, what do you feel is is like uh, the the biggest impact? That uh, that that uh, that companies like yourself make uh, overall, you know, in, in basically fighting uh, climate change and, uh, and the destruction of the environment. Yeah, um, I think the main target today is uh, bring awareness. Uh, 
make make sure that people know there is solution. Uh, I think we're all aware that there is problem. Uh, we see the plastic everywhere in in the streets, in the nature, but often we're missing a solution. And by an event like this today, uh, we I see many, many, many solutions from uh, logistics, from uh, energy, from of course packaging, and is what I find GP beautiful. And seeing all this company together and trying for better Vietnam, better uh, environment is beautiful. Yeah. Mm. Oh, that's fantastic to hear because mm. then it sounds like, look, you know, yes, there are problems and we recognize those, mm. but the trick is that actually the technology is there to solve it, you know, mm. to fix it, right? Yes. And yeah. then through that, to ensure that we, we, we can we can live, keep on living as we do, uh, you know, with, with, with essentially uh, 0% carbon emissions and, and such, mm. correct? So if you look at, uh, um, you know, the, the industries that you feel need to pay most attention to this. What type of industries would you prefer to work with? And which, where, in which industries would you yourself uh, see yourself be like uh, the best partner, you know, to help them deal with this problem? Mm -hmm. Today we, we see like the, all the manufacturers. Vietnam is, a, is one of the biggest manufacturers in, in, in the world. Huh? I don't talk about China and with another level, but still is one of the main uh, plastic polluter is from manufacture. And it's what, where we focus our efforts by proposing any kind of packaging that can be an help to reduce all this impact. So we have the garments, we have the furniture, we have the food processing, uh, we are consuming a lot of plastic and today they have the solution made in Vietnam for them. Yeah, fantastic. So these are typically the industries that you will be focusing on. Exactly. Yes. Yeah, great. So when you think in general about your business, are there any other messages, any other things that you'd like to share today? Uh, yes, yeah? uh, I want to, to talk to my other owner, business owner. Uh, I think it's our duty today uh, to not just make profits, but we have a duty against the society to help uh, the society to be better. Uh, and it's our choice that we make in, in our business that will change the world, I guess. Uh, faster than authorities, faster than anyone else is the choice we do by producing our our business. And making the right choice is very important. The solution are here is just us to make the, the good choice for, for the future. Yeah. I think that's a great message, right? It's like it's not just the business, but it's the solution and basically the responsibility you're exactly. taking in order to build a better and braver future exactly. for everyone around yeah. us. Right? And a better brand as well. I yeah. think it's very important that by saying to our consumer to say, okay, we try to do better for the for the environment, we will have a recognition for, for the public and for the consumer. Yeah, yeah, fantastic. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's great. So, Thank you. Mr. Uh, Jonathan Surinta, yes. it's great to meet you. Me Thank you to have, uh, to have a quick talk with us. And uh, I really hope that you enjoy the rest of GEFE. I'm sure. And uh, we'll come to see you in the booth again. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. All right.